Morning folks, Friday morning. Welcome new subscribers, thank you very much. And thank you for those that have emailed with your uh, details. So spread the word, keep them coming. We'll get this register up together. Uh, 1250s, 1200s. So uh, yeah, I'll uh, again put the email in the description. So anybody you know has got one, get in to contact me. Location and serial number. Let's get this thing, uh, some history up together of what's left. Anyway, in the meantime, it's half past seven. I'm down for retest with this one. So uh, over the pit, a little quick check of the bits we've done, brake test, and hopefully out of here. Get back and do some more. And guess what? Millfield again today. So here we are at Millfield again. Electrical issues in here. Just tested the battery. It's dead. Not even enough to light the uh, the tester up with. So uh, we'll stick a new one in and see what happens. Here we are in the depths of beyond. One battery. As you can see, we'll connect that up to the tester. Which, if there's anything in the battery, that should light up. Nothing. So we'll plug a new one in and go from there. One new battery fitted. You have lights that work. Charging thing there says charging. So I guess they must have just left something on, flattened the battery that it's dead and died. So hopefully that's an easy fix. We'll put uh, that on and see what's coming out of the charger. Well, we like easy fixes. I think what happened, they'd left something turned on and turned the isolator off and the battery was dead. So new battery on, everything works. So uh, yeah, we get on back, go and drop the other battery off that we didn't need. So I can't remember which size it was. And we'll uh, call in and pick up some supplies for uh, apprentices to do some detailing or some badges. So she did such a good job of the last ones. I've got another three to do. I'll keep you busy. Run it. <laughs> you can't wait. Oh, it's Friday, by the way, so you've got two days off coming up. Yes. This would be like a kiddie in a sweet shop. Lots of toys in here, but we need bits from here. Well, I never did. <laughs> that made me chuckle. <laughs> so, just getting rid of these. Got the two new seals put in those. But unfortunately, I haven't got them for those, so I've got to order some more, so I'll get on that. Hopefully they'll be here early part of next week. Then we get these sent back to the customer. And apprentice has uh, we picked up a new horn button. So that one's fitted. And hopefully we come up with an alternative solution for these lights. My man's gonna order some up. So uh, yeah, that'll be another little bit done. And more deliveries. Primer, red paint, black paint, hardener, cups, and a few other oddsies. So uh, yeah, that's not bad, I ordered that yesterday morning. So uh, well done Western Spray down at Credison, thank you very much. So we've had a quick measure up, there's some numbers there, off the 1250 radiator fan, which we're missing one. So I'm gonna try and make another one. Did one successfully, but 1250's totally different, it's bigger, and it just angles and slopey bits and yeah, curved bits in the bottom. I did one a couple of years ago, don't see why I can't do one again. Apprentice is up there busy, sorting through trying to find parts so uh, let's chop this up and see what we can possibly get to go wrong from back of a fact packet sketch to what mix could be in the bag i wonder hmm let me think oh this is the order of all the window seals and rubbers for farmer phil so yeah they've all turned up all he needs in there so we'll get this sorted and uh, hopefully get away to him next week well, that's enough brain ache for one day. Got the basic shape there. I've just got to do the bottom. But that's got to, I suppose, have a curved bit in the middle of it. So we've got the top done. Hopefully the angle's right. Measurements line up with what I've got written there. So, sod it, that'll do. And you down there praying? Yeah. Praying you're going to get it right. <laughs> yeah, it's nearly time to go and pick the kids up. It's like five to three now, so you better look sharp and get ready to go. Never mind, two days off. Yes. Morning, folks. Well, it's a bit chilly here this morning. Ice on the windscreen. So, uh, uh, yeah, I've been uh, going through emails of people who've uh, let me know their details of 1200s, 1250s, uh, jotting those down. So, uh, spread the word. Anybody's got one, you know anybody's got one, get an email me. Email address will be in the uh, description below. Or look on the Facebook page, uh, Massey Dave. It's on the last posting on that one. So I'm gonna try and uh, get on with this Vanguard shroud from 1250. Uh, see if I get that finished off this morning. And hopefully I might have a visitor here in a bit. So we'll see. Anyway, 
Look who's turned up. Pete Nash, Somerset Agripex. He's brought me a present. He obviously felt sorry for me. <laughs> Very. <laughs> for, for cutting these holes when I did my tape measure and uh, screw thingy. Um, yeah, he's putting with this. very pointy, sharp ends on. So, trammels. The trammels, yeah. So, I, I can now uh, do proper circles, which will be just a job because I haven't cut this one yet. And also, one other thing, what have I done with it? Where did I put it? Oh, there. I'll see. Uh, don't want to drop it. One very nice mug. With Massey Dave on it, so thank you, Pete. That's all right. Thanks, Mel. Thanks, Kieran. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry, Mum. We can see you down there. Kieran's hugging the bottles of uh, stuff I give him for the raffle prizes. Don't drink it all at once, Kieran. So, Pete, yeah. Thanks, Dave. Thank you very much, mate. I can't, Pete. Advertise your uh, your raffle prize, which I've donated a couple there. So. We're um, on Somerset Agri Picks on Facebook. We're supporting Young Lives Versus Cancer and National Autism Society. Uh, we got a lot of good prizes on there. Please read, go over there and read all the terms and conditions, hoping to raise some good money for them. Thank you very much. I'll, um, I'll put the links um, in the description of the video, so uh, it will be there for you to look and go over it and uh, yeah. Give Brilliant. him a thumbs up. Thank you, Dave. That's Karen. It's right, Mum. You're still there. Okay, back to this. We've used the thing that Pete brought around, so we've got a nice scribe line there for a nice circle. Mark tape. Now we've got to cut this bit out here and make the curvy, shapey bit to go in the bottom. So that's going to go something like that into place. Then we're going to have a bit to go in the back. So we'll, uh, we'll cut that out and then make a bit to fit. And then glue that in, and then we cut the hole out. Then all we gotta do is mark up the three slots on the sides. Job done. Easy as that, wish it was. Why, well, if I say so myself, that looks like a dodgy Dave work of art. Got a nice shape on that. Oh, I'm pleased with that. That is the dog's doodars for a Saturday morning. Massey 1250 radiator cowl. I reckon that'll do. We've got the three slots cut in each side. We've got the little garden bits put on there. Nice shape in the bottom. Pleased with that. I'm not going to paint it yet because I want to pre-fit it. But I can't pre-fit it because the rest of it isn't put together. But at least the basics are there. If I've got to fettle it a little bit, I can do before I paint it. So, all right, that'll do for today. It's been a busy week. So, uh, yeah, let's wrap up here. Righto, folks. Well, welcome new subscribers. And thank you for those that have emailed me with your information on serial numbers of these 1200s, 1250s. Please spread the word. If you know anybody who's got one, or you've got one, email me. Description's in the... Uh, description links emails in the description below and likewise for uh, pete's raffle prizes information's in there so go and have a look buy some tickets it's all for a good cause so in the meantime nice sunny day bit cold this morning but again sorry bit random stuff last couple of days uh but as always click the old like and subscribe give us a share drop us a comment be nice to get the 3000 i'll do a live question and answer so in the meantime I'm going to have an afternoon off and get ready because I'll be back in tomorrow morning to do some more. So until then, laters.